Hello everyone, I hope you are doing well. In today's video, we are going to see how can we generate database diagrams with the help of Marmaid and Draw.io. We will use ChatGPT to generate the code of Marmaid. But before starting, did you watch my previous video in which I talked about how can we generate system diagrams with the help of u.com and Marmaid.js. If you are new here, I am Asan and I post tutorials on this channel. If you might be interested in watching those videos, consider subscribing to the channel. If you have any questions, Comment now on this video. Let us start today's video without any further delay. So first of all, open ChatGPT. You can just go to chat.openai.com and there you just need to first type what is marmaid.js. We are doing this to avoid syntax errors because sometimes ChatGPT does not recognize what is marmaid.js. So we are just reminding ChatGPT that what is marmaid.js. After that, I'm going to say ChatGPT that I want to create a social media app so I need a database or a SQL code for my app. So I'm going to type prompt for this. I want to create a social media app and then you have to type give SQL code or database for my app. Let's see what is it is going to generate right here. So it is generating tables for the app like users, post, comments, post likes, friendship, etc. So these are the essential SQL tables for the social media app. Now let's just ask what are some types of database diagrams. So I'm going to type what are some database diagrams and then ChatGPT will list all the database diagrams in here. So it is mentioning entity relationship diagram, ERD, database schema diagram, UML case diagram, DFD, schema diagram, normalization, dependency diagram, logical versus physical diagram. So these are the types of several types of database diagrams commonly used in database design and management. Now we are going to just create these diagrams. Obviously we can't cover all of these diagrams and Marmaid also does not support all the diagrams mentioned here. So we are just going to create few of them. So now what you have to do is to just go to marmaid.life. So you can just search on your bar marmaid and dot life it will open the marmaid dot life editor or you just can go to dot raw dot io which is more easy to use and it is customizable according to your needs so you can just go to draw dot io and it will open the editor for it it will it may take some time to load but it will open it you can choose one of the options right here so i'm going to just save my diagrams to my device and create a new diagram you have to select blank diagram and click on create to blank create a blank template. Now here we go. We have a blank template for this. Now we are going to generate marmaid code for the entity relationship diagram which is ERD. So I'm going to type give marmaid JS code for creating or generating. You can just type anything for generating ERD for my app. Press enter and let's see what it gives us. So you can see the tag right here ER diagram. This is the marmaid built-in function you can say that so we are going to just use this code and paste it in the draw.io to see the code first let's check in the marmaid.live editor so it says that error parse error on line 9 so let's just check where is the error i'm going to just copy it or what you can do is to just go to the bottom of this prompt and click on regenerate let's wait for it you can also see that it is just creating the tables or classes for the tables that we created so the reason was asking for the sql database or code was to just understand chat that these are the tables and you have to create the classes for these tables so let's try this one and let's paste it right here so i think the problem is some something right here so what we need to do is to just go to the github library or repository of the marmaid you can just type github marmaid and open the first one which is the marmaid repository and then you have to find the example for the erd so erd is actually also a class diagram but let's see you can just open one of them and you have to go to sample diagrams and you will see er so i'm going to just paste this code in chargeability and you have to type this from the sample code for generating er diagram is given below and paste that sample code here and you have to also type now let's generate my or you can just type now let's generate er diagram for my let's see what it gives us now I'm going to copy this code and paste it in Marmaid and it worked. So you can see that these are all the tables that we previously generated 
user post comment like and friendship and let's copy this code and open it in draw.io so in draw.io you can just go to the range then go to insert and then go to advance then you will find the option marmaid let's just paste the code here and insert it okay here is the code for this er diagram you can easily customize this diagram you can change the colors by just clicking on this like this or you can just change the text or whatever you want to do with the diagram you can obviously drag these things right here or adjust it according to your needs so this is er diagram now let's move on to the another diagram which was mentioned by chat gpt and let's see what it generates now so it is database schema diagram so it's actually this diagram provides a high level overview of the entire database schema so now let's just copy our previous prompt and just change the diagram name right here i'm going to type database schema diagram and press enter let's see what it gives us now it has generated it let's copy the code and first paste it in marmaid okay it also generated this diagram obviously it will be different from the original form of the database schema diagram because marmaid does not provide the functionality for producing or generating the database schema diagram but it used graph td for just creating a skeleton diagram for database schema so you can also generate or import in draw.io let's see i'm going to arrange then insert go to advance and then click on marmaid and paste the code right here and insert it so here it is the database schema relationship diagram now let's go for another diagram so the third diagram was about let's see umlk class diagram so it is very much similar to er but let's just create it so i'm going to just paste the previous prompt and paste the diagram name here uml class diagram and press enter let's see what it gives us now so you can see that it is now using class diagram for generating uml class diagram it is using sql tables as classes just like in er so class pose comment like friendship etc let's copy the code and import it in marm in draw.io go to arrange then insert then advance and then marmate paste the code here and insert it so here is a er class diagram it looks like it generated it accurately because i think it is looking great it also uses the access modifiers like private and public etc also use functions and obviously these are the variables or you can say column names so let's move on with the fourth diagram and the fourth diagram is dfd so let's just copy our previous prompt and i'm going to ask the same thing and it is our prompt and you have to remove erd from here and then database flow diagram and press enter so obviously dfd does dfd is not available in marmaid.js now it is using graph td for just generating a skeleton or a diagram which looks like data flow diagram we generated it let's copy the code and import it in draw.io go to arrange then insert then advance and then marmaid so here is a dfd which may look like this diagram obviously as i said before marmaid does not provide this functionality let's check another diagram if i just move on to the fifth one so it is a schema diagram i think we can skip this because it is going to use just graph td for generating the diagram and for like the database schema diagram so let's try normalization diagram i have never tried this before so let's try this and you have to copy the previous prompt and then copy the name and paste it right here and press enter let's see what it generates i'm going to paste it in marmaid so it generated the normalization diagram but let's move on to the draw dot click on insert and then advance in marmaid and paste the code then insert it so according to chat gpt this one may be the normalization diagram so we can remove this one because it was our previous diagram so according to chatgpt this may be the normalization diagram for our app so it may looks like this it is the original schema right here then it says first normal form right here and in here it says third normal form and second normal form which i think can be extended if i ask to chatgpt just like the first form so we just tried few diagram which was mentioned by chatgpt that these are the several types of database diagrams commonly used in database design and management so you just saw that we can create erd and class diagram perfectly in marmaid with the help of draw.io and we can also edit it in draw.io but you also saw this we can generate the exact original form of the other diagrams like database schema diagram or normalization diagram 
because Marmaid does not provide this functionality. So if you like this video, click the subscribe button and don't forget to click the bell icon so you will be notified when I publish the next video. Thank you guys for watching.